Hello everyone, this is Enrico Palazzo. It's been a while. Today I'm gonna show you how to replace your iOS Spring in your BMW 5 Series F10 or F11. First thing you got to do is put your car on the stable floor and use, use your parking brake and lose all the screws in the wheel. You need to use a 17 millimeter socket. I want to, to use my impact wrench for that. To do this properly, you can use the thing made with ra rubber like this. I got it from China. So you you cannot then damage your floor in your car. Now the easiest step. Full power of my impact wrench. The next thing we got to do is secure a car from falling down to the floor. I will use my wooden block like this. And that's the IS pink. To remove that from a car, we need to re remove the air hose from the uh, compressor on the on the bottom of the, on the rear bumper. If you want to lay down under your car, make sure that your car is lifted properly. And now we need to re remove that cover from the rear bumper. There's the two 8mm screws and some plastic pins. Most of the BMW engineers want to be sure that no one could steal your compressor. So <laughs> you need to remove one more cover, the two screws, 10mm. Here guys, my mistake, two more screws here. We have to make a research which house is, is from this IS pink. I think it's the blue one. And there's a blue one house here. We need to remove that and put out all the air from the IS pink. Be careful when you are removing that house because there, there can be 100 psi of pressure. So. Be gentle doing this. If you want to remove the spring from your car, it's pretty easy. You need to click down from the bottom and, and, and rotate to, to the right like this and remove that like this. And that's all. And once again, the air hose and now that's it there's the old one and the new spring so we need to, to, to take that from the old spring to the new and, and the top Okay, and now the spring is, is ready to, to come back to, to the car. The only thing you need to do to put back your eye spring is put it up to the socket like this and rotate to the right, as you can see. And now it's is stuck in the car. Socket on the bottom and that's all. For that you need to put back the air hose to the compressor hub and once we if we have done that we we need to, to force the, the compressor to start up. We have to put back all the screws. You need to clean the brake disc surface like this. 
and, and the wheel surface like, like this so that's all thanks for watching I hope you like it please leave the, the, the thumbs up and subscribe to my youtube channel thank you so much and see you next time bye